Hey guys, Chris here with Phantom Buster. And in this video, I wanna show you the LinkedIn search to lead connection flow available on phantombuster.com, which will help you extract LinkedIn users from a search or group, auto connect with them, and keep track of who accepts your requests. All right, let's get started. All right, so to get started using this flow, we wanna head on over to phantombuster.com and click on Browse Phantoms. This will take you to the Phantom Buster web store. If you wanna get a full in-depth overview of using this flow, you can simply click on LinkedIn search to lead connection and it'll take you to the Phantom overview page where you can see a full overview of how to use this Phantom. And if you click on the tutorial tab, you'll get an in-depth tutorial step-by-step -step on how to use this Phantom. All right, so now I'm gonna click on use this flow. Now you should already have the Phantom Buster Chrome extension installed on your browser. So as long as you're logged into LinkedIn, you can click connect to LinkedIn, then click save. Now here's where you wanna tell the flow which profiles to invite. You can do a regular LinkedIn search, a sales navigator search, or a LinkedIn group search. For this tutorial, I'm just gonna use a regular LinkedIn search. Now you have several options for your inputs. You can use the URL of a single LinkedIn search, Sales Navigator search, or LinkedIn group. You can use the URL of a Google Sheet containing your search or group URLs, and you can use the URL of a CSV file containing your search or group URLs. Just make sure that the CSV or Google Sheets are publicly accessible. So I've already gone over to LinkedIn and I've done a LinkedIn people search for Phantom Buster employees that are my second and third connections. So I'll go ahead and go to the URL and select all and copy. And then in the input section, I'm gonna go ahead and right click and choose paste. There's also some advanced settings for the number of results to extract per input, the number of invites to send per day, and which times you wanna send the invites. We recommend weekdays during working hours and the name of the column containing your inputs if you're using a spreadsheet and have multiple columns. You can also choose to use the second Sales Navigator team instead of the first. For now, we'll keep it simple and I'll go ahead and click Save. Now here is where you write the connection message that you wanna send in your connection invite. So I've already created a notepad with the connection message that I wanna use for LinkedIn employees. So I'll copy this and then go back to the input section. I'll go ahead and right click and choose paste. If you wanna personalize your connection message, you can use pound, first name, pound, and that will pull in the first name of the person that you wanna connect. Keep in mind that LinkedIn limits you to 300 characters per message, and that if you're using the pound first name pound tag, that the length of the names may be longer than the placeholder. You wanna leave a little room so you don't reach that 300 characters. And if you wanna send a connection invite with no message, just leave this section blank. Everything looks good here, so I'll go ahead and click save. Now here's where you can choose the notifications of this flow. In this case, I'll choose none, but you can also get notified in case of an error, in case of success, or other advanced notification options. I'll go ahead and leave it as none. And under the advanced settings, I can choose to use proxies or other critical advanced settings. Everything looks good here, so I'll go ahead and click save. All right, so this flow is ready to launch. All I need to do is go up to the top and choose Enable Flow. Now sit back and relax as Phantom Buster does all the work for you. I'll check back in a few minutes once this flow has updated and we've sent some connection requests out. All right, so I've let this flow run for a couple hours and I can see some results coming in. So far, I've collected 47 profiles. I've sent eight connection invitations and I've had one person accept my invitation. If I click on the Connections tab, I can see all of the data from all of the invitations that I've sent and the one request that's been accepted. If I want to download this information, all I need to do is click on Download CSV and choose where I want to save it on my hard drive. All right, so that's how you use the LinkedIn search to lead connection flow. To get started using this flow, make sure you go to phantombuster.com and create your account. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel.